So man, it's pretty crazy yeah, like how many electric crazy. vehicles there are on the roads these days. It's not motorsport. It's not motorsport. Motorsport. I want to take it apart and make it not work again. You know, with that, you don't do anything. You wait for your software update. Some race some project model. So this is our Tesla Model 3. It was just a matter of time before we got one. We're going to make some performance upgrades to our car to unlock it and see what it can really do. Hey gang, it's Brian and Justin here at Summit Racing and we are here to talk to you about a cool subject today. It's coming up more and more. It's the subject of EVs, electric vehicles. So we're starting to see more and more of them on the highways, obviously. We're seeing the charging stations and, you know, the cars are pretty cool and all the manufacturers are making them. Um, you know, it's, it's one of these things where they're going to start showing up at the racetracks. You know, I've already seen them at the drag strips, I've already seen them at the autocross and, and you know, a little bit of everything. Like Brian said, we're going to hit some autocross events, do some drag racing, and a couple track days too to see what this thing really can do. The Model 3 base model, right off the showroom floor, will run a 14 second pass. And that's, like I said, that's in base trim, doing nothing. Basically, you know, the base model, think about it this way, already running sub, uh, sub 13s, uh, sub 14s really, and then this guy behind us is already running about 11.5 in the quarter, you know, trapping right around a 117. Now the cool thing is, is even the base model is, I mean, it's comparable to a Hemi Cuda LS6 Chevelle. Yeah, I mean, it's... I mean, it's but very, do you consider it a rivalry or not? Oh, uh, it's, everything needs a great rival. So like you said, you have Camaro to the Mustang and you have the Viper and the 911 to the Corvette. So to breed great things in the automotive industry, you need something to compete. And this is competing right now. Well, okay, and so we are Summit Racing and what do we do? We mod cars and we see this car as a great it's a blank canvas for yeah. us. We're planning on unlocking the performance potential of the Tesla with some strategic upgrades. You know, we're going to put tires on it, wheels, some suspension stuff, and really see what this thing can do. We have all sorts of stuff planned. My only problem is, is I can't figure out where we're going to put this. <laughs> right, right. So we are somewhat racing after all, and we put cams and everything. But no, seriously, we do have a lot of cool things that we're going to do. And, and like we said, you know, the car is pretty good out of the box. My driving impression on the thing is, you know, low center of gravity, you know, even the tires on it, you know, that are on it are pretty good, uh, you know, and suspension seemed pretty good. The steering was pretty good. Acceleration was awesome. You know, it's, it's a completely different thing. I mean, what were, what were your thoughts? This, this was the first time I've ever drove an EV and it's, it's just a different, like I said, it's hard to compare it to something. It's the, the, the instant torque and just the way the car handles overall is just quite like nothing I've ever drove before. And I'm excited to see what we're gonna unlock with some of the upgrades we plan to do to the car. Please hit like and subscribe and you're gonna see lots of videos, ring the bell, all that business. And of course, everything is here at Summit Racing. You're gonna see articles on this and videos. And uh, yeah, just keep watching, we're gonna have it.